This past week, I've had a lot of work on my plate. From my department, I was to watch and edit over 100 videos, transcribe 33 videos, and do a whole lot of work besides, coupled with some domestic issues and some inability to sleep in the last three days. The last thing I want to do is to write the script for this video. But as I lay back before my device, trying to be inspired on what to write, I realized I may have to ignore this and do it later. But then I remembered what someone recently told me. If you don't do what you should do today, you will eventually have to do it tomorrow under a tougher condition. So, do it anyway. In other words, when you put yourself in a challenging situation, where you either do what you need to do or die trying, somehow, you will find a way and do what you need to do. Why we get nothing done In our quest to achieve our goals as young people, one of the dangers we will encounter is a mind deception that we still have time. You will think that you can always pull it off till tomorrow, what you can do and should do today because you are young. Your feelings do not agree with it. You do not feel up to it. So you don't make an effort to do what you must do daily so you can move your life forward. I remember when I started learning to write. I had read author Jeff Goins' tip on how to become a better writer. He said, if you are just starting out, don't write a lot, just write often. With that piece of advice, I started to write every day. I can recall it didn't matter how bad I felt each morning when I wake up. I would leave my room by 5.30 am and walk to a small library where I would be alone. I would be there to write. And for several months, I did that, never missing a day. In a few months, my writing got better. I felt better because I was living the life of my dreams, all with weeks of sacrifice. Most young people think achieving dreams will never come with sacrifices. No. You will burn the midnight oil. You will have to stay up sometimes to get done with what you need to get done. Although, there are so many teachings now on why you should never get a job but to start a business. Accurate as that may be, you may need to work a job before you start a business. Working a job is not bad if your goal is simply to raise capital or gain more experience you will need to build your own business. But that you won't labor hard before you hit the success mark? Don't even think of it. When you put yourself in a really tight position, where you know that no matter what happens, you have to get done with what you need to get done. You will do it anyway. Each week, I have to write a certain number of scripts for the videos we publish on this channel. When we started out, I have been away from writing for a long time due to health issues. I was concerned as to how I would be able to write so many scripts. I started anyway. I put myself in a tight position. I either write this number of scripts per week or die trying. Do it anyway. Nothing gets done, which you do nothing about. Nothing gets done, which you don't act upon. Situations will remain the same as long as you keep waiting for things to get better until you fix them. I have discovered the best way to do something when you are very down to even do it is to start to do it anyway. The cliché is still true, but when there is a will, there is a way. When you are willing, you will find a way to get done what you need to get done. Thus, you don't do what you need to do, not because you can't, because you are not willing to. Your life success is hinged on doing not what you can do, but what you must do. Your life success is hinged not on doing what you feel you should, but what you know you should, and at the time you know you should do it. A writer told the story of how he learned to become a man by handling responsibilities. When he was a little boy, he would avoid doing things by running to his mom whenever his dad wanted him to do it. He didn't like to paint, but one Saturday, his father wanted him to join him to paint a part of their apartment. The 12-year-old snuck to his mother's side and argued that she should convince the father not to paint. The mother said to the father, He's only 12 years old and he doesn't need to be here with us all day. He needs to be enjoying himself with his friends. Then the father said, Emily, I got this. One day, that boy is going to be somebody's husband and somebody's father. There are going to be people depending on him. He has to learn how to do what he has to do and not what he wants to do. The woman said nothing. The boy learned that lesson and grew up with it. As young people, we must learn to do what we have to do, not what we want to do. This is the only discipline that makes for success. I know there are moments when the last thing you want to do is that thing that will move your life forward. As young people, we are faced with a constant temptation to do what is easy and to ignore what is difficult. But if you do not learn to do what needs to be done and not what you want to be done, you will keep struggling through life, wondering why you aren't hitting success like your mates are. Do what you need to do, no matter how difficult it may be. Do it anyway. I was insomniac for one and a half years, yet, 
through the pain and hurt my brain felt. I still wrote as often as possible and wrote books and content for clients. Yes, I have been lazy in the past, doing only what I feel like, but after suffering the consequences of my actions, I have learned that life is not about doing what you want. Life is about doing what you need to do. And no matter the cup that life serves you, you must be willing to do what is necessary, when required, to the extent that it is essential to enjoy success in life. The book will not write themselves. You must get up and write them. Don't wait. Write them. The skills will learn themselves. You must get up and learn those skills. Don't wait. Start learning them and practice them daily. Becoming a successful person won't happen suddenly. You must be willing to pick yourself up to do what you must, whether the conditions agree with you or not. This is the only way successful people keep achieving repeated success. Do it, do it, do it, or die trying. If this video inspired you, like the video. We love you.